Good evening, guys, and this is uh, just yet another night of uh, East 1 and 2 on the TurboGrafx-16 version. Hmm. Ah. And uh, normally I'm breaking my cardinal rule by saying I don't stream during Ducks or uh, Giants games, but uh, given the fact that the Ducks are down 3 nothing in their... Uh, current game right now and it's getting out of hand, you have every right to call me out for being a bandwagoner on the team. You have every right. Uh, and you have every right for me to just uh, give up and hang up on them uh, during their darkest hour. You have me <laughs> down on debt to rights on that one too. But, you know, sometimes there are things that are probably healthier to follow than sports. Or at least things that I'm better off tying my emotional state to. So that's why I'm playing this game right now. Oh boy. Yep, I'm lost. And uh, I did look up some maps and found out the next uh, piece of, equi of equipment I'm supposed to be looking for. Okay, that's not where I want to be. Turns out the the piece I'm looking for is uh, upstairs on the northeast corner. I tried looking for a couple of maps on it, I didn't find any uh, completely detailed ones, or rather I'm just looking at all the wrong places. But otherwise, we uh, should be able to get that piece now. Yep, here it is. So I have all the silver equipment, which is nice. Cool, I got everything. After 20 minutes of trying to wander around last night trying to find it, finally found it. Now, um, there is going to be quite of a bit of a long grind on the next few minutes just for the boss. Yeah, it's that bad actually. Alright, so I just need to kill 80 more enemies. Fun times. Let's just go south a little bit. Alright, let's go downstairs, grind for the next 20 to 30 minutes. And, uh. Mmm. Yeah, regarding the Ducks game, uh, my, uh, tablet's set to, uh, vibrate the next time I get another scoring notification, so, uh, I'm covered on that front. Unless you want to tell me to score yourselves. In which case, I'll appreciate that. Ow. Power. Do these guys yield? Yeah, usually I spend uh, more time than usual grinding down here, even at points where it seems really pointless. But let's just say I really need that extra XP because this next boss kicks my ass. So where am I going? I, wanna f I already have, I already have everything from down here. I already have the silver equipment. I already have a pow. I already have the keys. I already got the fruit and harmonica, which I needed to get for the silver sword in the first place. All right, so uh, I'm just gonna grind for a little bit, and hopefully hope for a dent in the scoreboard for the ducks. <sighs> yeah, that was where I got the keys. Don't need that. Alright. 
do I need to kill about? 15 more enemies? Alright, I can do that. Or let's just kill the birds, I think they yield 4. Yep, they do. Yeah, this next boss is usually uh, tougher than nails, that much I have to admit. Alright, I just need one more. Okay. Looks like we're good with that one. At least I'm not playing Chronicles uh, yet. Yeah, the thing that kind of irks me about Chronicles compared to this one is that the level cap in that one is only 10. I'm like, 10 levels? And not to mention that you you hit that cap uh, right at this moment, and considering that this is only half of the game so far, it's uh, comes as a bit of a surprise and a shock. Let's, uh, let's see if we can tackle the boss. I I, I hate the boss. I I hate to admit that, but I do. And it. And I hate it because it's annoying, and uh, you'll find out how in just a bit. Save. That. Slow motion. Got all the silver. Turn on the power ring. Okay. Yeah, I can't uh, open the door. Okay, it's on slow. Yeah, it, it, it's these freaking bats. Your only window of attack is uh, when he manages to form together. Yeah, that's why. Let's try that again. Are you okay? That's uh, one hit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I gotta get out of here. Yeah. The. Uh. I might have to grind a little bit more. Kinda told you that's why I hate this segment. Let's just farm the birds a little bit more and then, uh, hope I get something out of it. Yeah. That... It's like, even when I think I'm ready, I'm not. Yeah, if the birds yield about two, I'll just keep farming the birds. Oh, congratulations, you freed yourself from Facebook. How does it feel? Liberating? Yeah, these birds still yield two. Oh, this is gonna take quite a while. Wait, what? Or is it only one? That's oh, two. Hmm. Yeah, this is gonna take quite a while, so uh, usually I don't like to bog uh, bog down with grinding in a cave. It, there's also a segment in the in the following game where um, you're grinding in a cave with, with uh, no help. Am I getting off? Mm. Yeah, one of these days I will. Although, granted, that 
might have to take that statement with a grain of salt because I really don't use it anymore and uh, eh. I was gonna say dollars to donuts uh, some of my friends are only contactable through that because they like moving a lot or their lives are very mobile mine's not Let's see how, how quickly we can get through this. I just need 2,500 and I, I've already burnt out all of the... What do you mean duplicating? Is it just like the same cookie cutter uh, form or... Uh... Yeah, one, one of these days I might have enough in terms of uh, just people hack, just having enough... Uh, account chicanery to say, uh, I'm done. Because apparently some people, uh, keep posing as my friends on Facebook, uh, and I, and I, I look at the, I look at the sender links, I'm going, you're not my friend, it's like, you're not one of my friends. What, my, my friend doesn't typically sell me out like that. This is a typical three-point play, repeat a hundred times. Make, make that repeat 30 times. Yeah, we'll just keep doing this a little uh, stupid three-point play and then... That should be enough to tackle the boss. I hope. Yeah, I don't, uh... Yeah, I usually try to diversify my accounts as much as possible. So, uh, one of them's definitely my work, one of the- two of them are definitely for- three of them are definitely for entertainment. Wow. Uh, Oh. Oh, okay, I thought uh, someone else uh, screwed you over with that. Uh, Alright, yeah, I kind of didn't see that right. Oh, that's nice. Uh, you're, taking, uh, you're taking a lot of good precautions. That's healthy. I'm just hitting back and forth on the pad. Yeah, this should be enough. 66. Yeah, the point I learned to stop is uh, when everything just yields uh, 1 XP. Powerful I might, but powerful I might think is a stretch, but resourceful, yes. All right, let's uh, let's see if we can tackle the boss. I think I'm ready. Yeah, everything yields one. Uh, shouldn't be any reason. I wow, I've only spent 15 minutes grinding this segment. That's my luck. Alright, let... Alright, let's 
do this again. Alright, speed, slow. Okay. Yeah, that, that door's closed. And, uh... Yeah, these, these goddamn bats. Ow. Alright. At least I can hit it in three strokes. And as if uh, I survived to make those three. Ow. Ow. Okay, we're done. Uh, those 15 minutes really paid off. Okay, good. Okay, that's the third volume. Okay, this door is open and, uh... Huh. Two empty pedestals. Yeah, earlier in the game there was a guy in the village who said, uh, yeah, these two pedestals are supposed to be the rooms with the goddesses in them. Uh. Well, we're done with that. Okay, where I want to go is to Manea. Fast speed. Let's get, let's get everything while we can. Alright, we're done with uh, this stuff. Alright, uh, I already got a potion. <laughs> Let's just buy this for posterity. Alright. You ever been hacked? I've had my Facebook account hacked once, but uh... I managed to mitigate the damage a little bit. Yeah, n nothing personal of mine compromised, though. It's like, all you really have is just my face, and that's about it. But otherwise, yeah, it made me really leery to use my real last name. Eh. Online ever again. Yeah, there's no one here. But otherwise, my other accounts, mm, far less so. Or not at all, really. Where'd the poet go? Huh. Well, let's ask around. Anyone know where she is? Silver sword. Eh, ring. No. Let's talk to these guys. Eh. I've already heard this stuff. Hmm. Kids play under the tree. Yeah, well, yeah. It looks like there's there's nothing more. We're we're done here. Okay, that's uh, that's pretty much everything I need. Cool. All right, let's uh. Finally, after two and a half hours, let's advance the plot. Oh, we're in the most secure way. Hmm. Alright, that part's done. Okay. Uh, why don't you hire the thieves to protect you? Alright, so, uh... Let's read the books. Alright. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yes, that yes, this entry is just one page. Uh, that's all three books. Raining books must be in Darn Tower. Last of Evil. <laughs> Looks like the thief's this old lady's son. Hmm. Alright. Let's see if she has uh, anything more. Nah, it looks like the same line. Alright. We're done. Okay, now to advance the plot even further, and this is what the other half of the game consists of. So, uh, I've already done everything I could ground side, and yeah, you need all three books and you need all three of the silver pieces to advance the plot. If you don't, then you're gonna have to find all three of the silver pieces. The sword being the most uh, obtuse to find. Alright. We're spot. Oh, I have heard about your bravery. You're going to Darm Tower to find the book, aren't you? The locals here call it the Tower of Death. You can imagine why. The door only opens from one direction so none of the gruesome creatures inside can creep out. Once you go in there, you'll never be able to get back out. If you are really as brave as they say you are, and the entrance to the tower is at the back of this house. Good luck. You'll need... Uh. Yep, here we are. <sighs> Welcome to the second act of the game. This looks like the dungeon. Alright. We're fine down here. There's two staircases that lead upstairs. One of them uh, leads you to uh, a bunch of items and the uh, one of them uh, keeps leading you uh, to the top. This should be the one with items. Yeah. And for some of the equipment you didn't get earlier, uh, you'll get them here. So uh, some of them will be items. Okay, I'm gonna need that ring. And another heal potion. Wonderful. Yeah, the chest to the top, it's uh, It's one of these uh, three items. But I'm not gonna tell you uh, why they're a little bit generous with that. Or maybe you'll figure it out, I don't know. Gap there. Supplies. Wonder who's in here. 
Huh. I don't know who Colin is. Alright. Said he lost his eagle idol. Yep. These guys hit hard. Right, should be going up a little bit further. Yeah, and essentially all your money's worth nothing here. You get maxed it out, but where's the fun in that? Right, what's over here? All right, more uh, hard hitting guys. Another chest. This is going to be a long ascent. What's in here? Uh, no. Hmm. Hang on, let me see what's on the other side. So one of these is definitely a route to an item. Not much I know. This room I know is used for something. I forgot what its purpose was. Okay, yeah, uh, yeah, another level three chest. Let's save up here so I don't <laughs> have to start all over again. Yeah, th th this tower. Yeah, this 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 is used for something. And the nice thing to know is, uh, outside, they're all safe zones, so you can always heal and, uh, double your heal rate with the heal ring out, out there. Now let's, uh, see if we can head up a bit more XP while we're in here. Uh, I want to be at about 140 health when I uh, reach the top. And uh, one other thing I uh, kind of casually forgot to mention is uh, these two games play uh, back to back, meaning uh, your experience is carried over throughout the whole ex throughout the whole game. So it's not like uh, later releases where both games are discrete installments and uh, each has their own level cap. This is essentially a one continuous experience. The level cap is, uh, I believe, 60? Or somewhere close to that. Alright. Uh, I, I think I've, uh, I think I've grinded enough in here. Let's move on. This was programmed. Mm -hmm. Like with every other uh, development tool back in the day, but this one had the benefit of a CD drive. <laughs> your level design, your collision physics. Well, you need collision for the combat system to work here. Yeah, classic old Red Book audio music. Hmm. Yeah, these pillars are smashed. I I wonder why. Hmm. So let's do. Yeah. <sighs> All right. Yeah. Um. That's why they get. Yeah. This is why. Uh. Those chests give you level 3 equipment. <laughs> it's like your silver stuff got stolen. Hello, I'm Ludic. 
Gemma. Not long ago, I was walking through the many corridors of this tower. As I turned a corner, I came across a long hall with many stone statues lining its walls. Suddenly, an old man appeared in front of me. As our eyes met, he panicked and disappeared into the wall. Soon after, I was caught by the goons. Hello, I'm Luda Jenna. Not long ago, I was walking through okay. the many corridors of this tower. As I turned a corner, I came across a long hall with many stone statues lining its walls. Suddenly, an old man appeared in front of Yeah, I thought I would trigger a text box, but and disappeared into the wall. Seems that's not the Soon case. After, I was caught by the goons. Oh. oh, this, uh, this guy. Oh, uh, here it is. Okay. That, that's the idol. Yeah, I don't know about AI set routines, but I really want to talk about those. Oh, and uh, yeah, uh, it's uh, currently 15 minutes left in the third period of Ducks Oilers right now, and uh, yeah, the score is uh, still Ducks Trail 3 0. <laughs> I hate sports. Why do they? Uh, why do sports always have to tear tear our freaking hearts out at the most in in inappropriate times? How the hell do they do sixty? Damn. Oh crap. I, I didn't say beforehand, so. Oh, great. Yeah, I should have saved after busting out of the cell. Whoops. Fights almost happened at a gas station when the Falcons lost the Super Bowl. I, I wouldn't be surprised. It's like. It's like give up something like that at, at the championship. Uh, yeah, you'd be pissed. I gotta replay this bit again. Uh, at least, uh, hmm. Nah, I don't think I want to bring that up. Uh, I gotta play this voice again. Hello, I'm Luda Gemma. Not long ago, I was walking through the many corridors of this tower. As I turned a corner, I came across a long hall with many stone statues lining its walls. Suddenly, an old man appeared in front of me. As our eyes met, he panicked and disappeared into the wall. Soon after, I was caught by the goons. Okay. Yeah, okay, I know where that corridor is. Yeah, note to self, at least safe before I tackle that corridor again. Alright, so... 
Yeah, at least your town didn't go on full-on riot, like, uh... Okay, this is the one I didn't want to mention. Like, when the... The Vancouver Canucks blew, blew a game 7 to the Boston Bruins, and basically the entire city rioted. Did, did that kind of thing happen in, the, in Atlanta when the, they lost to the Patriots, or, uh... That didn't happen. Ow. Ah. Alright, uh... Okay, you know what, let's, uh... Let's try to skip the fancy stuff. Okay. Ah. Oh, it was just depression, not full-on riot. back as a uh, thing. Yep, that's the idol. Ah. Yeah, you guys should have should have had that. Although there were like a couple of plays where I started doubting, I'm going, wait, what are you guys doing? Such as that entire part where uh, all they needed to do was just to uh, score a field goal to put it away, but <laughs> probably just uh, burn it badly with that entire sequence where you lost 20 yards where all you needed was just another 10. It was just what a... Uh... Ah... Uh... Incomplete pass, then a holding penalty, and like 5,000 other things. Oh, and a sack. Yeah, you, got, you guys had. It's like the Falcons had that. <laughs> they had that. Everything still hits hard. Uh. Yeah, it definitely meant more, more, more to you guys. That was your, that was your second appearance, and that was the Patriots. Uh, that was the Patriots' sixth winning appearance. I think it was, uh, what, their eighth or ninth overall? And the only two times they lost in the Super Bowl was just uh, Eli Manning and the Giants. So they, so yeah, they, they've been there. The Brady Belichick Patriots have been there a bunch of times. And they've had a stranglehold on the AFC East for about, what, 15 consecutive seasons? Yeah, because uh, the last Patriots win before Atlanta was uh, against Seattle uh, two seasons ago. That was... That was a thrilling one, I'll, I'll admit that one. That, Nothing could have topped the oh crap factor at the very end. Okay, I'm going a little bit too high. I need to see if there's something I can grab down here. Yeah, given how um kind of chaotic the NFC South is, I need the brooch. 
Yeah, you you might not be able to. Well, you can def well you can definitely get by the Saints. Well, if uh, their lack of defense still gets laughed at. It's like why'd you guys get Adrian Peterson when you needed defense? Okay, I got one of my weapons back. That, that'll prove to be a big boon. Yeah, and uh, the bucks are actually looking good again, and uh, I'm not sure if the Panthers just had an off here, but if, they, if they're doing something right, then they do a lot of things right. We need new sports. Uh, Yeah, and uh, you guys, uh, yeah, and Atlanta had a hockey team twice. Uh, apparently, uh, ownership gave no shits, and uh, that's why they're gone. Because uh, you had the Flames, and they went to Calgary, and uh, you had the Thrashers. The ownership group didn't give any. Uh, you guys definitely have an You guys definitely have a major league soccer team. Uh, they just de they just opened up uh, this season, and. Uh, well, what do you know? It's owned by the same guy as the Fal same owner as the Falcons. Yeah, you you definitely have a you definitely have a soccer team now. I don't I don't know how they're doing. I don't follow soccer as much. Hopefully, you might be able to find something some solace in that. Oh yeah, back to the. Yeah, back to the, the Thrasher situation. Uh, uh, apparently, last I checked, ownership didn't really give too much of a crap about the team at all. And, uh... Rather than fold, uh... The... <clears throat> Winnipeg was looking for a new team, and uh, they were hoping to get the Arizona Coyotes back because the Coyotes were bleeding money. And uh, also, they were the original Winnipeg Jets. They were moved to Arizona because the Canadian dollar was weakening and the, you know, population boon in Phoenix, blah, blah, blah. But, yeah, unfortunately, they couldn't get the, they couldn't get the Coyotes. And note about the Coyotes, they were actually owned by the league. As in, yes, the league actually owned them at the time. But yeah, they decided not to give it to Winnipeg. Instead, uh, they managed to give them the... They gave them the Thrashers, and they're the new Winnipeg Jets. So, mm, I don't know what it'll take for Atlanta to have another hockey team again. And there's definitely going to be expansion for a 32nd team quite soon. We're just waiting for Vegas to settle in. Alright, oh. What's this? Ah! Damn it. I guess I know where I'm going next. Oh boy, yeah, there's a there's a lot of climbing up here. I guess I found what I'm looking for. How the hell did I get hurt like that? in here. Yeah, some... Okay, that, that is not where I want to be. Alright. One more. 
Just gonna full health real quick. Nullified. Let's see uh, what's in here. Uh oh. Okay, that's just a. Uh... <laughs> Does no one find these games interesting? Well, maybe you probably haven't considered that I'm not a good commentator at all. Because I have a lot of dead time in commentary. Right, let, let's see what else I can get over here before I can go upstairs. Okay, that's where I came in. What's on this side? Well, then again, there's not a lot of action in this game. I mean, that and this is a... Oh! Oh, crap. I missed something. Guess I got the silver shield, or... I hope. Yep. Yeah, I... I was afraid of this. Yeah, just weave in and out and uh, don't get slashed by the <laughs> what looks like the bloody Sizer leaves. Just uh, take it out as far as you can and take pot shots. Okay, that's a little bit too far for my liking. Yeah, that's off angle. Hot shots. Okay, good. <sighs> that took too long for me. Alright. So, what do I get? Okay, I'm gonna need this. And... Well, uh... I can't go back downstairs and read the book, and I can't read the book. So, fast motion. Alright. Okay, so uh, I knew I was missing something. Let's go back upstairs. Those uh, creepy statue head things. Ugh. Ow. Well, they still yield a big chunk of XP, I'll give them that. Okay, yep, bounce house. Oh, leave me alone. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. I did not want to redo that boss fight again. 
I, I dodged a bullet. Alright, let's save and uh, let's uh, keep going up. This looks like nothing I want to hit just yet. What else is down here? I, I like. I, I want to look around on this floor first. Other than everything dealing like 50 damage to me. Turn on the armor ring so I don't get hurt as much. So I can still thrive on contact. If I'm hitting the mirror. Alright. Okay, this is what I want. Yeah, because I need to smash one of those. Uh, Oh, yeah, yeah, that's, uh, okay, that, that is not where I want to go. Ow. Thank you for dying. Yeah, you can try to make it through that room, but uh, you only go, you'll only get as far as one place. No. No. Nope. That's like what you want to do is just uh, hammer one of these pillars with the... Yeah, hammer one of those pillars and you'll be able to kill the music. Don't ask me how that works logically. Huh, what's this guy doing here? Hmm. Ah, save a girl, huh? I wonder if it's that, uh, poet. Does that? Yeah, trust me, this game gets a a little bit more faster paced as we uh, move on. Cause uh, yeah, climbing up this tower is a long slog in and of itself. Okay, now that we killed the music, yeah, if you manage to make it this far, uh, you'll find the old man, uh, the one who's looking for the eagle idol in here, and uh, he'll tell you what to do. But beyond this, uh, you're dead. And uh, not even the heal potion will save you through that. So, uh, here we are, the next segment, I hope. Yeah, 25 floors of this stuff. Uh, uh, don't be very surprised. Okay, that doesn't look like anything I want to be doing. Alright, let's uh, go upstairs a little bit more. Alright, here's the, the mirror rooms. Uh, in later versions, uh, the track is repl- Ooh! So, 16th floor, find the girl, strong black ma magic, and, huh. Uh, 
Oh. Alright. Yeah, I'm not looking at my viewing demographics right now, so, uh... I honestly can't tell you for sure, uh, if the numbers, uh... Yeah, look for the green number below my screen. Uh, there should be a green number next to a dot. That tells you how many viewers I have. Not the gray one, the green one. Alright, what's this room? Oh, another boss. Just bloody wonderful. Yeah, if yeah, this doesn't work out as planned, I'm just gonna... Save... Yeah, it's probably just you. Yeah, I, I'm not ready yet. Yeah, I gotta grind for a little bit, so, uh, yeah, bear with me as I have to kill another 30 enemies. Or, uh, 38. Make that 28. Yeah, no other. Yeah, I can't kill anybody in this mirror room right now, so, uh,. I'm gonna have to go all the way back downstairs. So I have to go through that long, winded hallway again. Yeah, definitely so. I can't, I, I, I can't carry a broadcast by myself. Uh, truth be told. I mean, if we're gonna be doing Mac Warrior, then yeah, there, that's not a problem there. Uh, can't believe I have to go all the way freaking downstairs. Well, let's see how much more we can grind up to. Yeah, because uh, I can't access anywhere in that mirror room. I just can't. Now these guys are yielding 16, that's how I know I'm not ready. Yeah, this is gonna take a while. 63... 79... Alright, and this one should be... I hope that's enough. I mean, one of these days, yeah, if I ever do, uh, Mac Warrior 2, uh, yeah, I'd definitely, uh, like to bring you along and, uh, maybe somebody else so we can, uh, do at least a voiced commentary of the game. It'll, at least it'll be nice, but, uh, yeah, if you remember that little, uh, test I did on Discord when we were, when I was doing Iridium 2 and, uh, yeah, I hope we iron out the kinks by then. You know, uh, I have to solve my uh, bad audio balancing issues and uh, stuff. I. Oh, great! I have to repeat. Okay, let's let's get to five thousand and then we'll. Oh, great! Well, I just wasted a bunch of time with that. Uh. 
And I'm just listening to Ducks Oilers right now. It looks like the Ducks might have their second goal waved off. One of them was waved off by a high stick, and uh, this might be waved off for goaltender interference. Oh. Let me check the score real quick. Oh my. Oh, it's tied at three. Yeah, the yeah, the game the game winning goal was waved off. Oh, another overtime session. Holy Oh damn. Oh, uh, <laughs> Holy crap. Alright, uh, let me check the scoring place real quick. Yeah, uh, for those of you who are just joining me, I ended- I started doing the stream because- What? Huh. Yeah, I was, uh, I did the stream because, uh, Ducks Oilers got out of hand with the Oilers <laughs> leading three nothing at the top uh, at the end of the second, and uh, looks like the Ducks decided to tie it tie it up. So your scoring summary so far is a uh, Drysital, McDavid, and Kegula of the Oilers scored in the second period, and uh, for Ducks scoring in the third, you have. Ryan Getzloff scoring at 16 minutes in the third. Cam Fowler following it up uh, less than 30 seconds later. And you have Ricard Raquel uh, tying it up in the last 15 seconds. And then Kessel and then Ryan Kessler was trying to score the game-winning goal, but it got waved off for goaltender interference. There's your summary for the <laughs> there's your summary for the night. And uh, Yes, Ducks fans, if you're watching this, you have every right to bitch at me for leaving during the Ducks' darkest hour. Never count them out. I almost counted them out when they were down 4-1 against Calgary. I played Flight Simulator X, and then they managed to win that one. I hope they managed to win this one. Uh, I am such a fucking faithless sports fan. I'm horrible. Alright, let's... Let's see if we can make it. All right. Let's see if we can kill that rock boss again. Let's see. I it, we're, we're having another game going to overtime. I don't, uh, thankfully I'm not watching live with a bunch of alcohol in my system. Now it suck. Hmm. Three goals in four minutes. Holy shit. Forty-four twenty-nine shot differential on the ducks. Holy shit. Okay. I <laughs> I uh. Oh boy. I Boy. All right, I saved at this point. Set to slow motion. Oh boy. What? What am I doing wrong? Should I just be using the timer ring? Yeah, I, I, I don't think I'm even ready for this. But let, let's try one more time, and this will be the definition of insanity. Yeah, I'm not. I, I'm not even ready for this. I, I, I don't know why. 
All right, uh, let's, uh, there's a previous save we had downstairs. No. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. I have to go back down. Again. All right. Yeah, because, uh, I have to kill that rock boss if I want to open the mirrors, uh, down there. Oh, boy, this is going to be an even bigger grind fest than I imagined. Let's see if I can... Yeah. Wait, you ran into ads before I came in? Huh. I don't know, I didn't turn on a... I don't turn on ads usually. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I'll uh, see if I can cut down on the... Like, if I can cut down on the login ads. Because I think I put it at run at 3 and I'm not... <laughs> I, I, I didn't set up revenues for this, so... Uh... Hmm. Every time you first log on... Huh. Wait, is it ads every time you go into the site or ads every time you get on the stream? Because I haven't had that problem yet. Alright. Alright, so uh, I gotta grind this one, so it's gonna be 24 experience every 10 seconds. Oh, it's every time that you go on the stream. All right, uh, yeah, I think I can do something about that. There's uh, how many, how many of them are there? Three or uh, yeah, that, <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, the, this is a Falcom game. Good music is the norm. Yeah, I, I I like to play the Chronicles version of the tracks, but uh, unfortunately I have to check the. I didn't get to save them, so I'd have to look up the the listings to see which uh, which which files they are. Yeah, uh, enjoy your conversation for a while. I gotta grind another 150 experience. Yeah, with NetMech Discord, uh, we'll definitely try to... I want to see that if one of us can do a, a live stream of MechWarrior 2 or NetMech, and uh, we can always have a, a little voice line set up. That, that's the hope. Alright, another uh, maybe 3 experience, so another 11 of these guys will do. Okay, yeah, uh, all right. That's nice to know. Thanks, Matt. But you just say as long as you keep it civil, right? So don't call <laughs> all angry vi video game nerd on on audio. Ow. Okay, these guys are giving up 4 XP. I think I... 
This is as far as I'll go. Save, and then file number three. Ah! Just another healing moment. Yeah, this has been 20 minutes I've been doing this part. Probably because I haven't been grinding enough. Okay, just ca casual trash talk banter. Uh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. This part I just hate because there's a lot of dead time, and uh, you don't get enemy, any enemies down here, and uh, you have to go back all the way down four floors. All right. Yeah. It, Alright, let's hope I can cheese this boss. Let's hope. And about that mirror room, uh, if um, you guys want to just skip my uh, rather crappy commentary and uh, hate to repeat that music, uh, look up uh, East 1 and 2 Chronicles rendition of Dreaming and just play it every time you're in the mirror room. Trust me, you'll have a much more fun time listening to that than listening to me. But, yeah, let's... Uh, yeah, save it until I'm in the mirror room. That's as ready as I'll ever be. So, here. Let's hope I can. Ah! Okay, yeah, I have to time my attacks. I, I can do this. I can do this. But hopefully, I can do this before the end of the night. Attrition. We're done. Alright, that's good. Need a uh, brooch so I can navigate the mirror rooms. Uh, another buck. At least we got that part out of the way. Uh, no, there was never any net mech for Ghost Bear's Legacy. I mean, the closest that people have ever gotten for it was uh, just trying to hack 31st century combat to fit some of the mechs in, but otherwise, uh, no luck. Alright, what? Ow! Let's see, uh, where is this one? Alright. What about Ghost Bear's Legacy maps? Okay, um, some of the maps from Mech, from NetMech were used in Ghost Bear's Legacy, but not the other way around. So, um, the second strike, uh, the Ice Caves map, the one on Grouse, that was used for, uh, that was used for the Trials. Okay, this is not what I wanted. Yeah, so, uh, the, the map from Grouse, you know, the ice cavern map from Netmech, that was used for the, the blood trials. And uh, Outer Volta, that big city I keep insisting on for whatever godforsaken reason, uh, <laughs> as in the one where I keep ill-advisedly picking stock mechs, yeah, Outer Volta, the, the big city map, yeah, that was used for Strike on Moritz, you know, the one where you basically have to level an entire town. 
so uh, you can get the other half of the genetic material. That map was used also, and the last one, uh... Oh, great. Uh, no, no, no underwater. No underwater, please. Because you'd have to do a lot of tweaks to make it. If it was just like some some other map, then I wouldn't have a problem with that. But yeah, duh, yeah. Don't ever suggest that. It's not funny. I mean, the one thing I did wish was that we had uh, something like water effects. Okay, yeah, this is what I wanted. Ah, no! 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 But something like a... Something like a river map, or lakes, or... Places of the... Places of the sort. Ah... Uh, is this the... Yes, this is the one I'm looking for. Thank you. Yeah, but nowadays it just becomes a really frickin' cumbersome to deal with. He is, uh, wasn't it in someone else's notes on the mech2.org forums that, uh, you had to once strip the engine down to a lot, and then you have to, you have to crank the gravity to ridiculous. So I think that's how they did it. As in, uh, yeah, change, change everyone to like a, <laughs> a a ten engine and the uh, or one hundred and just rack the and just rack the gravity like mad. Okay, I got the silver armor. I should put that on. Okay, we're ready. Uh, I'm guess I I would have guessed that the Marauder was the original pick because it would. It, it would have been the ideal energy boat. Okay, uh, what's this? Okay. Huh. Mmm. Or maybe in development they thought that the Marauder was a good idea, but then they decided to say screw you and just gave you the Executioner instead. But yeah, I, I, I would have picked... Yeah, honestly, I would have liked the Marauder. That, that, that's my choice. Alright, uh... This is the one. Yes! This is where I want to be. Okay, we're going upstairs. F finally. Although, um... Hmm. Uh oh. Hang on. There's gonna be a little bit of backtracking after this, so bear with me. Jeez, this room's empty. Uh, let, let's see. Yeah, cause I don't know what, what, what the developers were thinking giving you a... a four PPC executioner when the PPCs in Mech 2 weren't as good as the ones in, uh... three or four. Maybe it was beta. Maybe it was. Alright, so I got the battle shield. Uh, okay. This is a better shield than what I have now. Uh oh. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if we can make our way into the annex. I should probably save now. Yep. Alright. Uh, the other problem you kind of have with a MerkNet server is, uh, you're definitely gonna need everyone to have it. You're definitely gonna need a, whoever the host is to be it, to have a, to have a functioning disk. And given how much, uh, I have... Uh, I have not had any luck trying to get Mercs for DOS to work. I have not had that luck yet. And so here we are. Looks pretty nice here. Looks like this is the night view. It looks like the 
the village and the, and the big walled town. Yeah, if you have ho yeah, if you can host, then uh, yeah, th th that problem can be. Oh god. Yeah, uh, looks like I can't. Uh, I can't open the door. I'm gonna need something. Yeah. Let me try something. Inventory. Blue necklace. Evil ring. Okay. That's what I needed. Yeah, if you uh, wear the evil ring, uh, normally you're gonna die, but wear it in conjunction with the necklace. Adol, it's me, Lair, the poet. I knew you had the courage to save me, but to be honest with you, I allowed myself to be caught. I didn't know any other way to find you. I have something of great interest for you. You are aware of the books of Ys, but not everyone can read these books. I have a pair of glasses that will allow you to do so. You have shown your courage, and I see you as our only hope. Please, take the glasses. This was released in 19... This particular release, I want to say 1989. Maybe 87, I don't know. The demon who locked me here is Dark Fact. He is plotting to use his evil powers to make this land his own. You must defeat Dark Fact if we are to have any chance. Although, uh... All right. Okay. It's coated with a unique protectant. Okay, I need... <laughs> yeah, this one you have to wear silver. Right. Yeah, th this music is good. I'll, I'll give you that. And, uh, how, uh... And, uh... For how the voice acting was done, uh... I already told Event this, but I have to give you this explanation. Um, the company that did this, uh, that did the voice acting, was uh, TMS Entertainment, uh, Tokyo Movie Shinsha, if I remember correctly. Uh, these are the same guys uh, that did the voice acting for uh, Little Nemo Adventures in Slumberland. And uh, one or maybe two of the voice actors from that movie also worked on this. Well, definitely one for sure. I'll, I'll tell you, the narrator of this uh, played the, the Nightmare King in Little Nemo. And uh, hmm, that, that's pretty much about it. But uh, if you'll entertain my little banter about Little Nemo uh, for the moment, the one thing I. I know about that film because I had the VHS version. It was uh, released by Hemdale, who you probably know as uh, the guys who helped release the Terminator, the the first one. And uh, what happened when Hemdale folded was uh, they were bought out by Orion and then bought out by MGM. So. Anything that reverted back to its original rights uh, went to whoever else had them at the time. In Little Nemo's case, you had it going back to TMS. And uh, the one thing I will admit about a uh... yeah, this is on an emulator. This is on an emulator. Uh, leave me alone. Okay, I got to heal. Holy crap! Okay. Yeah, this is on an emulator. This is for the TurboGrafx-16. However, uh, this is not just your run-of-the-mill uh, TurboGrafx-16 game where it's uh, on a little card, so something like a Nintendo DS card or something like that. It was on a, it's on a CD. So uh, it's the t it's the TurboGrafx-16 with the CD attachment. Alright, yeah, I, I'm getting hurt. I, I I gotta call this quits. Ah, run!
<laughs> yeah, um, if you want to know its uh, Japanese name, uh, you'll probably know it as the PC Engine. And uh, if you want to want a game from the TurboGrafx-16 that didn't work out, if you watch the Angry Video Game Nerd, watch this Darkwing Duck episode. And uh, and Astral the. The Darkwing Duck game I'm talking to you about, it's not the same as the one I showed you when the ducks were kind of sucking uh, last... Uh, a couple days ago. Alright. Oh, a heal potion! I didn't need that! I think we're... Have I... Have... Me or Astro ever watched Deep Space Nine? Um, unfortunately, no. Floor 17. Yeah. I'm supposed to. Uh, there's supposed to be a part where I'm supposed to go all the way back downstairs and get something from someone, but. Because uh, I need that to access the final door. this guy. Huh. Yeah, I have no idea where I'm going right now, I'm sorry. I don't have all three of the... Ooh! Ah! Oh god, no! 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 Oh god, I... I wasn't expecting that. Uh, you're breaking my balls, game. You're breaking my balls. Yeah, I'm not, yeah, um, uh, <laughs> mm. yeah, it's like all my arcades, uh, they have a handful of, sh of light gun shooters, and, uh, well, well, mostly the racing games work. Let's see if I can go downstairs real quick. I have to get something. Ow. That's nice. Yeah, th ah, there's 25 floors in this tower, and okay, this is what I wanted. Is it something within four digits? Well, at least they can buy genuine arcade parts. That's the, that's the fun part. And then uh, you can probably. Uh, <laughs> well, I wish I learned a damn thing or two about 3D printing. <laughs> and we, 
and I could just fabricate my own. Oh, son of a bitch. Leave me alone. Uh, I got a firing sword. Just, just, just leave me alone. Alright. Yeah, this is... I'm getting... Wish there was an, an online GoldenEye 64 server. Uh... <laughs> I mean, you could probably do it on Emu. You could probably arrange. You could probably arrange for playing GoldenEye 64 on Emu, but however, um, they might tell you, please no screen peeking. Uh, as far as uh, other avenues for online GoldenEye goes, uh, if you've played Half-Life 2 and the, know of the Source engine, they so, some independent modders have managed to go and. Uh, Try to recreate the Golden Eye experience in Source in in the Source engine. So yeah, just yeah, look up Golden Eye Source and not a lot. And unfortunately, there's no single player campaign as far as I know. It's just the you could ah uh, great. I just lost my thoughts. I don't know. I was thinking about sustained conversation for this long. Oh, cool. Yeah. Um. $2,000 for Pac-Man, huh? Uh, is it just Pac-Man standalone, or uh, is it Pac-Man and Galaga? Because I know some theaters that I go to, well, actually, just the, just the UA I go to, uh, they used to have uh, Pac-Man uh, Pac and Galaga together on the same machine. I need to go, I need to go all the way back downstairs. I already have the while we're up here, add the glasses. Here we are. Hmm. I'm pretty sure uh, someone has it on. Uh, pretty sure GoldenEye 64. You could do it on Emu. All right, and uh, I want to read the this book also. Have you played uh, EA B Star Wars Battlefront? Um, I have not. All right, uh, yeah, I gotta go all the way back downstairs. Hang on. And this means I have to navigate the entire uh, BS of uh, of the mirror rooms downstairs. So I have to go to uh, that guy who got lost, that guy with the feather hat. Uh, hmm. Ah. All right. Yeah, it's like at, at that rate, you might as well just play Rogue Squadron all over again. I uh, I have tried playing Rogue Leader on Emu, but it's an absolute bitch. And the sad thing is, uh, it's actually pretty damn good. But yeah, I I, I can't play it on Emu. Maybe if I could <laughs> copy my uh, save file from my Wii to my Wii U, then uh, I don't know, just uh, do homebrew stuff with my Wii, then yeah, I'll definitely try it on that, on console. This is where I need to be. Yeah, because you have what, you have Rogue Squadron for N64, I, did, they, did they remake it for GameCube or no? Because I know Rogue Leader, the second one, and the most widely known, that's on, that's on GameCube, and uh, Rebel Assault, that's, all, that's also on the, the third one, that's also on GC. Hmm. the gold medals on the main game. Wait, was it... Yeah, that's what I was mentioning. Uh, yeah, Leader and Rebel Strike. The, the original, was, the original was, wasn't on GameCube, right? Just, just so I can clear the air on that one. Have I ever played the Battle for the Boot? Nah! The, the only Star Wars game... The only Star Wars games I had for N64 were uh, 
Shadows of the Empire and the Episode One and Episode One Racer. And uh, I, I also have the PC version of Racer. I, I, I don't know how the hell you get it to work on Windows Seven. I, I think I tried doing it on XP, but I didn't have any luck. I didn't have any luck on XP. Maybe if you can ask Disney, LucasArts, and GOG to say, "Hey, uh, hey, can you have this game?" I hope they say yes. Oh. My father has told me of our land's legend. He said that the key to defeating the demons lies in the books of peace. There are many mysteries left to unfold, but the books can be your guide. This is a charm that has been handed down from our ancestors of long ago. Take it with you. It will help you break the evil curse of dark fact. Yeah, this is what I needed. I, I was right to backtrack downstairs all along. Ouch. Yeah, it's like once once you get the book with this with his surname on it. <sighs> this episode has not been actually brought to you by Pepsi. But yeah, once once you get the. Once you get the Book of Gemma, which is actually the bug that belongs to his bloodline, show it to him, and he'll give you the amulet to unlock the final door. Hmm. Yeah, I... <laughs> If you haven't noticed for the last 10 to 20 minutes, I've already maxed out my money. And <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, there, there's nothing to burn it on. There's no shops in this tower. There is nothing. <laughs> and no, you do not get to do the thing where you get to throw money at your enemies. Let's see if we can make the final push. <laughs> oh man, you, you, you gotta tell Astral uh, the tragedy of Darth the play just the wise. Uh, who do I think? Who, who do I think where he is? Hmm. I don't know. I never really thought. <laughs> I never really thought of drawing up any theory. Hmm. Yeah, I can. I, I would buy. I would buy that theory. Uh, hmm. All right. Let's uh, see how much higher we can go. Yeah, it's like what, what, once we start the second episode, I'm. I'm gonna call it a night. It's already been a hundred minutes of grinding, and uh, uh, better not forget to save. Right. 
Ah, corridor full of bugs. This is good for grinding. Nah, I, I highly doubt Lando's dead. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if... if <laughs> I hope that's not the case. I, I hope someone... Wrote, I hope someone on staff wrote a letter to Billy D. Williams saying, Hey, are you willing to at least come back for episode 8? I hope. Oh. <laughs> or, uh, I remember hearing for like, uh... If... For the Han Solo movie, the best idea to frame that would be uh, to have Lando tell the story at Han's funeral. I, I would buy that as a framing device. I would. Okay, I think I. Okay, yeah. you, you know what? I'll find enough enemies upstairs. This is just getting. This is getting a little bit unsustainable for me. All right, all right, I can't, I can't do this. Yeah, just no turning back on this one. Hmm. <sighs> well, unfortunately, with Le with the uh, Leia's actor gone, that that entire plan is probably going to be monkey wrenched. Mm. Shame. Alright. Let's see if we're gonna make the push for this end game tonight. And just so you know it's not exactly the end game, but you know, the end of this chapter. Alright, I think I could Alright, this isn't 420 yet. Hmm. I, I was trying to find my my VHS. I was trying to find the. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, I forgot to wear the, the necklace. <sighs> and I, I know there's a fair share of flack for the Phantom Menace, but uh, you know you can't you can't deny that Duel of the Fates. You know the the song that plays when uh, Qui Gon and and Obi Wan play uh, <laughs> go against Darth Maul. Uh, that's a good song. And Astral, I uh, believe I showed you the that cinema in concert with uh, Duel of the Fates. There were like two versions of it, the filmicity of it, and then there was a cinema and concert. And I don't know, the one with fil filmicity, like it was good, like it was good as in the the instruments were on point, like almost one to one with the all, almost one to one with the original track. But it, it was just, but uh, it was just too fast for the vocals, and I think the vocals suffered for it. Whereas I showed you the cinema and concert one in the. That was a slow and a lot more doable. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I killed Jar Jar Binks. Okay, uh, have you watched the Robot Chicken Star Wars uh, specials? J j just watch the one where Jar Jar meets Darth Vader, like, a bunch of years later, and, uh... <laughs> You'll f you'll have a newfound hatred for Jar Jar after that. <sighs> uh, 
And uh, since I haven't mentioned it for quite a while, uh, uh, Edmonton Ducks at Anaheim Oilers is still tied at three in, in, in overtime. So, uh, hopefully, uh, the, hopefully this, <laughs> hopefully the Ducks score and the end my night on a happier note. Char Char caused the Empire to form. Okay, yeah. Yeah, you can definitely blame him for that one. Yeah, he. Yeah, he, uh. Not, it wasn't so much give, but, you know, convince the Senate to give him. This yes, originally was uh, supposed to be, uh. uh who, uh, it's, I think it was supposed to be Padme's call to see if the clone army would be made, because that's why she went to Coruscant in the first place to start the episode. Yeah, let, all right. Let, let's kill. Let, let's kill these three stooges over and over again until I got ten thousand XP. And I want to apologize for any long grinds <laughs> in this game. Hey, don't blame me. I'm t I just play the games. <laughs> oh, you like one and two, and uh, <laughs> hate three. Yeah, I, I kind of admit that for some. Uh, the way Anakin turned into Darth Vader seemed a little bit underwhelming. <laughs> All right, uh, I, I guess I'm, I guess I'm ready for the, the final boss. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a lot of XP to make up. Yeah, th this is gonna be a little bit too much to bear. Okay, that's 16 each, I believe. Hmm. Yeah, let's see if we can uh, do these three stooges a little bit more longer. Eh. <laughs> I. I wouldn't know. I, I wouldn't know how to react to that. Enough, I have enough health to take on the final boss, but you know what, let's just get some, let's get some insurance. Hmm. Wasn't there a, wasn't there like a little bit in, in the expanded universe where uh, Darth Vader ended up visiting Padme's grave? I remember something like that was supposed to happen. It was like during the Imperial uh, Occupation of Naboo or something like that. As long as you don't draw the ire of the... It's like, stop having romance in my Star Wars! Alright. Uh, I think this is the best I'll ever do. Floor 21. Alright. Yeah, we're, we're, we're approaching the end. Because uh, the last three floors are just one big staircase. Alright. 
save here. Here. Now, there's supposed to be one more boss I'm, I'm supposed to face before. Uh, okay, that is not where I wanted to be. What was the sand line? I keep, I, I, I keep drawing a blank on it. Is it like the I hate sand, it's everywhere and it gets in your eyes line? Uh, great. Yep, one more boss. Alright. Yeah, that, that was the second episode, wasn't it? When uh, they had that little heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Okay, because I think I remember that. Uh, uh, yeah, okay. Okay, good. Let's save. Hopefully I can take on this last boss. Okay, it's just you have to attack the one with the particular head. Yeah, wrong one. So I just attack the red head. We're done. Well, that was easy. Yes! Alright. Uh, this is as ready as I'll ever be. At least I hope. Oh, right, I forgot I gotta go to silver because uh, not, nothing works otherwise. I might buy that. Alright, uh, this is as ready as I'll ever be, so, uh, get okay, silver equipment, power ring. Inventory... Ooh, amulets. I can't use the... <laughs> I can't use the heal potion for the boss fight, so... Uh... Alright, uh... This is gonna be the last boss room, and... This is the last boss of uh, this half, but... Just... Soak in the music, and, uh... Just enjoy this. I don't think Snoke is a Tarkin or Windu. I 
I know you are searching for the secrets contained within the books. And you have done well so far. And I am impressed by your daring ambition. But of course you are still defenseless against my superior powers. The name Dark Fact will be the scourge of all men to come. <laughs> oh, you are brave. But you are also a fool. You have no chance without the protection of the silver equipment. I won't. <laughs> Silver. Brave, prepare to die. All right. Oh, oh that was <laughs> that was pretty quick. Oh. Hmm. Well, uh... Huh. The last volume in his cloak. Okay. Looks like we're done here. And all we have to do is just read the last book. Yeah. It's like, if you haven't read the other books, read them, and once you read this book, we're officially done. You ever heard of the, the Snoke being Darth Plagueis theory? Would you buy that, or no? Or is he just some... some ancient observer? Okay. Alright. Yeah, um, you guys seem to have missed this, but there's a big bright light shining around Adol. Looks like it didn't catch it.
you all right? Me? I am Lilia from Rand's village. I felt a cold shiver down my spine, and I felt compelled to come in this direction. Then I found you lying here on the ground, your body surrounded by a pure white light. This is the land of East. There are many goons patrolling this area. Quickly, let's go to my village before they find us. And, uh, well, this is the start of the second East installment. Welcome to Ancient East Vanish, the final chapter. An entire Rogue Squadron installment. Yeah, because I remember uh, some of the games, uh, they let you play as the Empire, such as... Uh, you play as Darth Vader, and uh, you end up ransacking the entire Yavin base. Huh. I have no money and I have no inventory anymore. Well, at least I got the books, but where's the fun in that? <gasps> Rance Village. Alright, so. Here's, uh, here's the later three accounts. Here we are. Oh, yeah, it's the one uh, where uh, <laughs> you kill Luke. Unfortunately, uh, yeah, nothing down here yet. I'm sorry. Hmm. Okay, I think I've heard enough. Lilia's house, I believe, or, uh, uh, why do I keep running into this guy? Which 
shield, sword shield, <laughs> short sword. I kind of wish this was more like Eternal, where uh, it's not just a tunnel that takes you to your ruins, but you know, you get to go enjoy the view. Hmm. Oh. Are BS and HS the same? Uh, uh, hmm. uh, what are you talking about? Like, uh, talking bachelor's of science and what's HS? Oh, bullshit and horseshit. Oh! Ah! Uh, hmm. No, our, uh, There were some. D I forgot. I know there's some different usages uh, for for those words. Uh, I just. There's definitely. Yeah, there's. Uh, hmm. Yeah, it really depends on the usage, but I forgot under what circumstances uh, those are used in. Which one next XP? 14200. Alright. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah, there was something on the guidelines of uh, how to use uh, bullshit, horse shit, ape shit, and dog shit, but yeah. I, I I didn't read up on the guidelines on how to use those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's definitely yeah. There's definitely differences in there in how you use them. But yeah, don't ask me. I uh, I haven't encountered every situation where I had to use those. Okay, I got money to buy myself some armor. What's this? Okay, I'm gonna need that. Ah, unfortunately, no. Yeah, I'm not sure if anyone managed to record any lives. Ah, shit. Yeah, I'm gonna guess no. You might be able to find some on the corner of YouTube, but like for any of us who were doing at mech2.org who've done it, I, I honestly don't have any knowledge of that. Alright, uh, let me get that ancient tablet again. I'm gonna need that. Yeah, these tree nuts. Uh, I think. Uh, oh wait, they they restore your ma they restore your MP, but that's about it. But yeah, honestly, I haven't seen any videos of us playing Merknet. Was the last time I actually uh, played a really good session of Merknet was uh, uh, 2009 or 2010 when uh, Not Sid and I played it and. Uh, some third guy and we're gonna crap a lot of fun with that. 
Is MMPD's net, net max server thing a client side server I mean, to Mmm. Mm. You could say yes. I don't know, uh... <sighs> mm, yeah, because he technically... Well, he, he's the owner, but, uh... I'm not sure if he made it all from scratch. Well, part about connecting to that, it was, uh... What do we do? We just, uh... Well, he owns the ser he, he owns the server that, uh... Uh, he, he captured packets using Wireshark or something. Um, okay, as far as technical implementation of how we got NetMech to work at all these days, uh, you'd have to ask him. I'm, <laughs> I'm not the kind of guy you ask for networking stuff like that, or, uh, you could probably ask, uh, Mig. He was the, the guy who managed to get the server emulation to work. But I don't know, uh, how often he comes. this guy <sighs> now these guys hit like a truck so ow okay I might just have to <laughs> stand back and heal for a bit Yeah, these guys uh, are bloody rock people, so... for this guy, seriously. At the end of this game, do you have full health? Yes, you do. You do. This, this, pl yeah, unlike, uh, the later versions of this where it treats, uh, one and two as separate, as, a separate installments, so you'd have your full health bar for the first one, full health bar for the second. Yeah, this plays is one complete experience, so, at the end of this, uh, you get full health. It's about 255, which is half half in terms. Why am I mentioning that? All right. Yeah, I I need this. Oh my. <laughs> okay. Uh. For, oh my. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, we actually should have a server tower at his house. And uh, for those of you guys who are wondering about the Ducks Euler score, the Ducks won. The the Ducks frickin' won. 
in overtime. Oh boy. <sighs> it looks like Corey Perry actually did something after all. <laughs> ah, nice. Very nice. Well, I got the power of magic, but I need to get <laughs> an actual magical ability to work it with. Right, so let's go back to town real quick. That took forever! Oh boy. And to uh, any Ducks fans, yes, I, I, I'm sorry that I <laughs> didn't, wa didn't watch it, but... Uh, I cannot wait for Clone Wars Adventures to... Hmm. Uh... Nah, I haven't. Uh, what platform was it on? Oh. Oh, okay. <sighs> Alright, so let's get the... Looks like that game's over and uh, <sighs> probably missed one hell of a game, but uh, do you play games by daybreak? Um no -uh, I don't. Or I haven't heard of them if uh Alright. Gonna uh, enter the ruins. I'm not gonna be able to do all of this, so um Let's read the six books again, and then, uh... Oh. That's about... Claria... Blessings of the Two Goddesses... But I don't think that's what that book was about. Those who ran away... This guy has book back. What did they replace Clone Wars with? Their own uh, Clone Wars series, or did they just flat out replace it with Rebels? Be careful in your fight against the bigger demons. You can't destroy them without the magic of fire. Alright. Nice thing is that you can get... Oh. Hmm. Alright. Nice thing about this dungeon is that if you know where any of the priests' uh, statues are, you can always come back to them to heal. Alright. Yeah, I don't... I... 
I don't... Yeah. Okay, full disclosure, I didn't grow up with the... I, I didn't have cable growing up, so, uh... And, uh... Well, let's just say I was stuck in <laughs> dial-up hell for the longest time. So, it's not... I wasn't really privy to it. Oh. So, uh, here's another book I have to offer up. I kind of feel that way too because sometimes uh, you know you're always gonna have your shows get pissed on and uh, you know I, I, I uh, you know for me it's like uh, my <laughs> the current batch of cartoons I'm watching you know it's just Adventure Time with Finn and Jake you know regular show Gravity Falls okay admittedly I was late to the Gravity Falls party so mm. and currently uh. Star vs. the Forces of Evil. That's a good show. I recommend you guys watch that. Oh, what's this? I don't know, is it? Okay, I'm I'm gonna need a pick. I'm gonna need a Matic. Okay, I'll come back to that one soon. What's over here? I'm gonna, I wanna find the magic of fire so I can get some good offense, but should be chest in here. Dead end. Ah, leave me alone. Okay, here it is. Alright, so... I have enough offense for now. Ah, no! No, no, no. Oh, crap. Oh, I gotta start this whole bit over. I'm gonna see if I can tackle the boss, and uh, we'll call it a night. I'd, I'd like to do, um... I'd like to offer up all six books, but, uh... Let's see if we can get, to, get that far, but I think I've burned enough of your time already. Yeah, back to my uh, point about uh, like the stuff I watched earlier. Uh, there's just a I, I don't know why is it just my attention span dropping or something? Is, is a mm, or is it just the fact that some shows just don't get promoted as much as others and. I've been going on all the wrong tangents. What's up for this? I just wonder what will happen to most of the characters in Rebels. Will you accept Darth Vader killing all of them? Because that could happen. Or, no, 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 I'm, I'm pulling that out of my ass. Alright, this is the second offering. Just don't give me any money. Okay, fair enough. Okay, I have not watched Rebels at all. So, yeah, I'm not really qualified to, to speak on that whatsoever. I don't know, I... I, I 
I don't watch that much television. And currently, I've been trying to catch up on watching a few movies that I DVR'd. I mean, what have I DVR'd recently? I've DVR'd Blue Velvet. Uh, what else? Um, a Smithsonian documentary on the F-15E Strike Eagle. That was another one. Uh, what, what the hell else have I DVR'd right now? Uh, there was something else I had, but I kind of utterly forgot about it. To be uh, another offering. <laughs> uh, I, I <laughs> I don't know, wouldn't you piss a lot of people off saying that? <laughs> or, hmm. Or there was something where we could. <laughs> oh god, I don't want to give them any ideas about playing Star Wars in VR. Where, uh, you're in the entire set piece and you try to play the whole thing live, like, uh, how, uh. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, literally, I really haven't watched a lot of Star Trek. Well, a lot of classic Star Trek. I know that they play Voyage on on BBC America ever since their uh, their reorg. They they play Voyager a lot, and I do mean a lot. I haven't seen them give a, give any. Binges for DS9 just yet. It's uh, yeah, it's just. Right. Ah, thankfully, uh, the magic cost isn't flat, so I can just. Just keep shooting them like this. That's not where I want to be. Is it this one? Yeah. Now yeah, there's a healing fountain around here. Okay, that's not the healing fountain. I can spam all the magic I want. There's. There's a couple statues in the game that will uh, enhance the function for you. And all right, all right so hmm. this is where I want to be. This guy is bucked back. Wasn't what wasn't Star Ocean ruined by that by the entire like the entire universe was just <laughs> was just a hollow deck imagination or am I not remembering that right? This should be the <laughs> I don't know I. Th I think you would have rioting in the theaters if that if that actually came to fruition. Let's 
So many broken hearts. Books have I given already five and I need to give up the last one. Alright. Let's go downstairs. And there's a boss tour around here, I'd like to know about that. Yep, that's a boss door. Uh, I haven't found a. I haven't found the Matic yet. Ever heard of? Uh, I've seen a few episodes of Star Trek Enterprise. The only two things that I'm aware of of that show were uh, the one where you had Peter Weller in it with the Terra Prime movement. That was the. Well, if you well if you, if you watched RoboCop, then you know who Peter Weller is. That episode, I, that episode I remember. The other ones were the, the alternate dimensions one, and the one where uh, apparently some aliens went back in time and uh, helped the Nazis win World War II and capture the the American East Coast. That's all I remember of Enterprise. Yeah, I have seen a handful of episodes on it, but I don't know. I I don't really have that many fond memories, to be honest. Been through this door. I think I've been here. Let's see what takes me back to the top. Should be a matic in this room. Is this it? Or Yeah! This is it. Okay, I found what I was looking for. Mm, 
なあエンティルーム These mines are really confusing. Was it this one? No, but I'm, I'm running in circles. It, it wasn't this one. Was it this one? Now that leads me downstairs, and that's the right do not want. To. I do not want to go downstairs. That's the. Wow, I got. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, let's go heal up real quick. Oh, I gotta get some fruit. Uh, the Mirror, Inter Mirror Universe episode of Enterprise. If it's the one where they found their, where they found another, where they found another Enterprise. Yeah, I think I've seen that one. Okay. What do I want it to do here? Let's see if this works. Huh. I'm guessing at this point it's probably a rebuild. I'm not sure if the hmm. Yeah, Corsetta Flower, I have to kill the boss for that. Let's uh Let's go back topside and see if I can Well Actually I don't think I see him point to that unless I can find a place where I can get some iron ore. Yeah, the, I'm pretty sure there's iron ore in a chest somewhere in this place. If I can find some freaking iron ore, then I'll be pretty happy. Oh, it looks like these entire mines are exhausted. At least these are well lit, unlike the mines in the original uh, the first game. Let's see. Now this takes me all the way back upstairs. That's right. I kind of don't want to be right now.
I don't know, I'm not that well versed in Star Trek to be honest with you. I don't need that. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I don't think. To find, well, if you can find a suitable body double who can uh, fill in for him, uh. Now let's see if I can find some iron around here. Because if I can do that, I can at least get some level 2 armor. Yeah, I admit they're good, and, uh, well, uh, James and his AVGN persona, don't you, don't you think he's kind of tempered down a bit? I mean, <laughs> there's not, I mean, there's only like a handful of thing, things that'll get him really pissed off, but, uh, you know, you, you have to go to, you know, nowadays, you have, you look like you have to go to very great lengths to, to piss him off. James. It was in, the, in his most recent episodes, uh, he's been quite tempered lately. Alright, let's see. Oh boy, am I gonna hate this. Save, mine two. And this is just gonna be a shoot fest, so... What the? Yeah. Oh, at least I can take this one. EA is the new LJ, and just my opinion, though. Um. Hmm. Well, in terms of, well, hmm. Okay, yeah, um, you got me there, but. Uh, 
Ah, uh, ow. Alright, let's see. Uh, there's definitely iron ore I can get down here. It looks like I have to shoot everything. Uh, have I ever played any of the original Battlefronts? Um, I have not. Yeah, go die in entire fire. Yeah, I'm looking for, uh... I'm looking for... Uh, yeah, that, yeah, I haven't, sorry. Oh. <laughs> I better save. Or is it just the... Uh, yeah... I kinda apologize in advance for that. Ooh, oh, no, no, no. Okay, magic of light. That, that helps illuminate paths. But... There's supposed to be some paths here that you can illuminate with the magic of light. I kind of like Eternals that take on it better, where uh, it's a, a glowing orb that flies around you, and it goes to any, and it manages to seek any hidden path. But this one, it just illuminates uh, certain lamp posts. Case in point, like that. Oh. No, 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 no! I'm gonna die. I am... I, 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 I'm gonna die. Have I ever played, uh... World... The World is Not Enough for N64? Um... Nah. The... I, I, I've only really played Goldeneye and Perfect Dark. I haven't played any of the other... Uh, <laughs> I mean, I, I have the fi... I mean... I mean, I, I do have the movie with me, but... Well, sitting on my VHS stack next to my TV, but I haven't played the game. Hmm. I wish I could heal. Okay, the evil bell. I'm gonna need that. Oh. Yeah, I, 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 I need a... I need to run towards a safe spot. I, I, I gotta see one of the statues. I, I don't have healing items, which kind of confounds a lot of my problems. Oh, are you talking about the? Are you talking about the expansion pack that goes into the back slot? I didn't know that. Cause I know when. Cause I know for Perfect Dark you didn't. Uh, you could you there's save slots on the. There's save slots on the game pack itself, and uh, if you wanted to, you could also uh, save it to your memory pack. And it. All right, so you. So they had no, so they had no uh, room for uh, static RAM on the cartridge. Is that what you're saying? Okay, that's the flower I'm looking for. You needed the expansion pack to play it. All right. Yeah, if it's the expansion pack, if it's the 
yeah, I kind of get what you're talking about, the expansion pack, where um, it's on top of the N64 and in front, and you had to cut it, and, uh, yeah, I know what you're talking Okay, I get it, I know what you're talking about. Ah! Uh. Great, now I have to do all this stupid maneuvering again. Damn it. Let's get the flower, and then let's uh, let's get back to one of the statues. Because that's what I really need right now. Unless killing enough of these guys can yield enough XP for me to, uh, 19600. I, okay, I can buy myself some time. Three games for six games. Yeah, because I remember Golden Eye would tell you whether uh, you had the expansion pack or not. I know Perfect you, Perfect Dark's already a good example of a. Uh, you must have the <laughs> the expansion the, the expansion to play single player. One other. What 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 was the third game that that required it? Was it Donkey Kong or something else? Myself, uh, three extra health. So, yeah, let's uh, let's get back to the statue real quick. I'll I'll, I'll come back down here because I know the iron. There should be iron ore down here if I'm right. I don't know whether Ocarina of Time or Majora's Mask required the, the expansion pack. But, uh, let's, uh, let, let, let's heal real quick. Now this is gonna take a long while for me to heal, but what the hell. Super Mario 64. I don't think it. I don't think it asked for it at all. Yeah, <laughs> I think if you just Wikipedia expansion pack. Uh, it should give you something. Still need to get a damn SNES though. Um, what what would I consider the the much needed collection for SNES? Mm, definitely Super Mario World, Yoshi's Island, Super Metroid, Donkey Kong Country, uh, Final Fantasy four and six. They're two and three in the. Well, back then they were known as two and three in the states, but yeah. Uh, what else was there? Secret of Mana. Uh. Chrono Trigger. Mm. Oh, what? What are, what are other ones I can name? Oh shoot. Mm, Super Mario All-Stars, that, that's another one I can recommend. Oh, there's the Iron Ore. Super Star Wars. Yeah, I've watched some of the LPs on it and uh, it was ri Parts of it just looked ridiculous. Inventory. Oh, there's 
there's nothing here. Boo. Are lit up, lit up around here. What about this one? Yeah, this. All right. This should be the. Yes. All right. So I got the rotatory nut, the crescetta flower. All right. Yeah, I agree with you on that one. Yeah, so, uh, to recap what I just said a few minutes ago. Okay. Yeah, the essentials are, yeah, the essential for, the essentials for the SNES. You already have Donkey Kong Country. Uh, do I have a Switch? <laughs> do, do, do I look like the guy who currently has a Switch? I'm just having a hard time try just trying to find one. But no, I, I haven't even had my... I, I, I don't even have my hands on a Switch yet. I, I don't. Okay, so back to the... Back to the Super Nintendo Essentials. Donkey Kong Country. That's a that's a no-brainer. Uh, Super Mario All Stars. Uh, just get it with Super Mario World. Yoshi's Island. That's another essential one. Super Metroid. That's another essential. Final Fantasy Four and Six. Secret of Mana. Chrono Trigger. Th those are your those are the RPGs I would name for it. It's probably. Uh, Super Mario RPG, Legend of the Seven Stars, that one I would recommend too. Mm. Damn, what, what, what other, what other games could I recommend for the yeah, SNES Essentials? I'm out of ideas, but... Paper Mario, Paper Mario for the N64. Uh, it's a great game. I've, uh, I, I, I just finished playing uh, Paper Mario uh, a couple months ago. I, I actually enjoyed it. Personally, I like Thousand Year Door better, but uh, let, let's just say there's a handful of moments in uh, Thousand Year Door that were kind of full of shit, in my opinion. Uh, Namely, the bloody Twilight Town arc. I I hated that. There there wasn't any single part in uh, Paper Mario 64 I hated. Thousand Year Door I I'd say was better, but you know uh, my opinion of that is kind of skewed just for that. All right, got some iron ore. Do I have a okay, thousand? 2500 Okay, good. I've uh, I've upgraded. Oh, I already had an herb. I haven't played Mario Party in ages. Hmm. You 120'd Mario 64. Huh. 
Yeah, that's good. Uh, Alright, so... Alright. Okay, this return magic, it's basically for uh, 20 MP, you can uh, warp to any safe house you want. I'm sorry, but I overheard you talking to Bernice. I was about to die of a disease I knew nothing about. But you risked your life to get the medicine that I so desperately needed. I owe my life to you. How can I ever thank you? Uh... Yes, I'll go into your house. Alright, so what I want to do here is uh, <laughs> upgrade my stuff and play this bell. Yeah, that. That's the thing. Oh my! Holy! No, 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 no! Ow! <laughs> do, do I play any MMOs? Um, not anymore. Uh. I mean, I tried playing Star Wars The Old Republic, but I couldn't get past the second hour of it. Mostly because, uh, well, this was before they ended up overhauling it to be a little bit more single-player friendly, so I might give that a... Well, Old Republic, yeah, I'm getting to that right now. Um, yeah, I, I haven't played it recently, but I do... But yeah, I remember playing it, uh... It was 2013 when I last played it, and uh, yeah, let's just say the experience wasn't fun because I couldn't find anyone to meet up with. And it wasn't until I heard it was uh, ah, oh, what was this? What was the second last expansion pack? Knights of the Fallen Empire. I think it was like after that they made it a little bit more single player friendly. I'll I'll see if I can give that a shot. I haven't played Galaxies. Why is no one getting hit? Ah. No, 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 no. All of you can go die in a tire fire. Okay, I, 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 I'm, I'm done. Now, now let's go return the last buck. They're probably not, but eh. If there, if, if, if there were your only a avenues, such as, uh... Okay, I, I admit I do play another MMO. It's Fantasy Star Online. I still... Yes, people still play that. The, the original one, I, do, I, I don't have two. Alright, this is the last book. But I highly doubt they are. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
If you want to grind like nuts, this is the perfect room for it. Unfortunately, uh, yeah, I shouldn't try to ram everything with my sword. Okay. Yeah, I I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to <laughs> barricade your basement. Doors open. All right, we're gonna end it tonight on here. Oh man, my, jeez, my legs hurt. Three hours and seven minutes. Okay. I'll see if I can continue this tomorrow night. Maybe not, but we'll see where we can go from the next week. Cause I might not be available all that much for the next. Uh, couple weeks. Can I post this to YouTube? Um, I'll see what I can do. I have to look over the footage first and uh, hope that none of the game day audio uh, is picked up because uh, technically I can't broadcast uh, content from any sports cast on this. I'll, I'll, I'll take a look. Yeah, if I, if I can't, I'll let you know. But otherwise, uh, yeah, I'll uh, post this episode and uh, the last, uh, the last one I did. So uh, if you want to watch the whole game, uh, you can catch up on it. Can't wait for all of us to be on the NetMeg Party Discord server and voice channel chat. Yeah, yeah. Maybe after this game, uh, or sometime later on, uh, or on request, I'll do Mech Warrior 2, and then hopefully we can all. Uh, have a nice party chat on that one. Well, at any rate, you've been watching me do uh, East Block 1 and 2 for the TurboGrafx-16. Have a wonderful night, everybody, and go Ducks!